this is me. And this is my story. I was popular. I don't want to seem arrogant, but looking back, I kind of had to admit I was. In elementary school, at least. I was one of the funny ones. One of the cool ones, you know? But I was really arrogant. I judged people faster than I even knew their name. And I thought that when I made it to middle school, I was going to breeze through all of it. You know, make all the friends, good amazing grades. But things weren't as they seemed. Only if I knew who I was becoming. So, fast forward to sixth grade. Guess what? Being arrogant kind of made me have no friends. I just kind of shut down when that hit me. I just tuned out the rest of the world and stayed alone. Every day, week after week, month after month, during that time, I thought a lot. And I would read and draw. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that reading and drawing are as bad as anything. I just want to point out that I used it almost like a crutch. It's taken me almost two years to figure that out. I just remember escaping in the different worlds, forgetting my issues for the time being, though it felt so good at the right time, it really wasn't looking back at it. So one day, I just decided at lunchtime that I should be nice to people at least. I shouldn't just shut them out and not give them a chance. And so I did. And guess what? I actually made a few friends. So fast forward to seventh grade, where I just had my confidence boosted up so high, it was crazy. I could almost talk to anyone without getting nervous. My grades did something I never thought they would, no, ever could do. They dropped. And so, like anyone else, I freaked out and tried to pull them back up. They went even lower. Soon my family got in the mix and yelled at me. They said they never expected that from me. Ever. And that hit me pretty hard. Nothing I did ever helped. I kind of went into some kind of denial and ignored it to the point where I couldn't anymore. Then, I made another painful rethinking of my choices. And I came up with another decision. I needed to find a balance. A way to keep my grades and have time for my friends. So I got over my chronic procrastination and actually did. I got my grades up and kept my friends by the end of the year. Now I'm in 8th grade and I realize now I'm going to keep making mistakes throughout my whole life even. And I can't stop that. But I do know now that I have a choice whether they will be the same ones each time. I just think that everyone should stop for a second and think about who they are and what others see when they look at them. I believe it's necessary to do that to be the best person you can be. And once you do that, you can find the balance in your life and you can keep the things that you love to do all under the same page. And I did this also and I found the balance of all the things I love to do. So in the end, I'm pretty sure that if you do that, you'll be a better person because of it.